you do me a favor? Move down a couple of stairs. Yeah. I hope you got the reference and if you didn't, well, I think it was funny. everyone you are watching thrifty tuesday it's the video which comes every tuesday where i style my thrifted outfits and before we will get to thrifted outfits let's take a few things out of the way first of all don't forget to follow my mom's advantage it's the instagram where i sell my thrifted clothes and all the outfits you will see today in the video will be actually for sale on my instagram account not this one this is one of mine i think it's really nice but the outfits which I will show you today will be there for sale. Both the outfits are you are about if you like something you will be actually able to buy. Another thing I want to get out of the way is don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, like push the button and have you? No? Not yet? Okay. Have you subscribed yet? So like we all know that YouTubers are being very annoyed with asking to subscribe to a YouTube channel and we know kind of why, but do you know exactly why? Like do you know the number? Come closer. I don't mind, come closer. Ready? Come closer. I need mean, more close. The number is, are you ready, right? 1,000. 1,000. I need 1,000 subscribers to start making some coins on YouTube. Currently, I have like 55 subscribers. I would be very thankful if you will help me to get to that 1,000 number. Ew. If you're being like, but like, why should I, I follow you? Let me tell you, I have been on YouTube for two weeks. It's my second YouTube video. And along the way, I already learned so many tips, which I will be happy to share with you. And then further, when I will be making first videos, I also will be adding those YouTube tips. So then later, when you will feel like you're finally like ready to make a YouTube channel, it's really easy to like, go for it. You will have like all of the list of the mistakes I did, which you don't need to do. So I think it will be fun for you and for me to have this trip on the YouTube lane together and see how I grow, see, see how I succeed. And if I won't succeed, I will fail. And like both ways, I think it will be like pretty funny. So yeah, push that button. I can wait. about YouTube are learning to mix. First of all, yes, you need 1,000 subscribers to start making money on the YouTube. Another tip is average time people spend watching your YouTube video. So it's very important number and you know, it makes sense because I'm myself a person who scroll through video. I don't watch video from the beginning to the end and it's okay, but when I found out that people do that to my video, oof, well, that hurts. My last video was about 18 minutes long. Do you wanna know? How long people spend watching it like you know actual time they spend watching 80 minutes long video guess no uh, less a bit less less the one I hear three minutes amount of hours I spent like uh, editing it and then like about the jokes and like I think it was funny right like right like I know you really like right you're not like the other ones I know like you watch it till the beginning till the end I know that right right like right yeah that's what I'm saying it was hilarious like jokes no thank you I know you are laughed out loud like I know yeah it was fine I know that right but could you imagine like some people watching for like three minutes that's just true that's just true so your yeah, average time is a very important thing and we need to find out how to increase it and that's the second tip I learned. And now I think it's probably more about like five minutes intro but I really wanted to share with you YouTube tips. Oops. And now we're gonna move to the outfits. Yeah, let's start. 
Let's go. Are we coming? I will, I will show you. We'll, we'll go outside and we'll show you some uh, outfits already. You wanna? Yeah, let's go. Sure. Let's go. Are you coming? No? Are you coming? Let's go. him obviously but oh my god you should read the sex in the city book i read it and it's just like mind-blowing it's so different from the series like here is actually like the person candice bushnell Bush, i wouldn't pronounce it but she wrote this book on her own experience it's like partially autobiography about her life and you know like mm, the book is totally different like you could absolutely understand big and why he did it because she was a uh, not just like a crazy party animal, but she wasn't there for the relationships. And the uh, series shows us absolutely different picture. And in life, Big actually moved out of the city. He met another woman, like some a tennis player, if I'm right, the person who was the big in real life. Yes, he is real. And yeah, he met the sportsman woman, sports woman, and they made uh, moved outside of the city and had the family. And he didn't even live in New York anymore. Like he was the family type. And the, what shows show shows us, hmm, right? So yeah, after I read the book, it, it was really, really, um, I would say, sad book in the way because it was 90s, 2000s, so many drugs and everything, and you know. But now I'm rewatching Sex and the City, and that's like totally carry, carry vibe. You guys, are you ready for the next outfit? Because it's gonna be fire. Yep. Mm -hmm. this YouTube video turned into what my favorite movie characters would wear in 2020. We had Carrie, now we have Buffy and we're about to have a few more. There is those types of outfits which brings your confidence onto the next level 
and this is one of them just look at me I like the outfit I'm enjoying myself I'm just perfect in my sassy element Well, this outfit you're about to see, I absolutely love it. That's going to be my favorite. Rachel outfit but I added some leather pants and I kept the leather pants and I added the blouse where's my drink in this outfit on. I think that's Blair in 2020. I added the leather pants because, like, come on, like, she's a badass. I don't know why she didn't wear, like, leather pants and all, like, that's contradict her, but then, same time, you know, if you think, like, she's a, such a badass, she just needs one pair of leather pants, you know? And maybe she was wearing one with the chuck bars of the scenes which were cut out because we were too young to see them. To be honest with you, I wasn't sure about this bag because it's not your usual tiny bag which everyone is obsessed with nowadays but the more I looked at it the more I liked it because it's just this perfect proper vintage classy bag and it's perfect in its own way. So the last three outfits were styled with the same pair of leather pants and accidentally again this video turned into something like hey look how differently you can style same pair of leather pants it was totally different style with styles we had different girls we had buffy we had rachel now we have blair let me know which style is closer to you And you know, have a good week and don't forget to thrift and check my mom said being ditch. But before we go, can we take like a minute to check my outfit? <laughs> of a granny and then like fashion and then some like naked boots and so I thrifted it yesterday and I think it's so nice first I saw it and I was like okay that's some granny's cardigan but I like it so much and then those leather pants look at those cuts
tip I want to share with you is just that it's really easy to film YouTube video. The video which you just watched, I filmed myself on the tripod and I thought you really don't need to ask anyone else for help. You can do that by yourself, you know, just do it. It's really easy. I forgot to say, don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching.